themselves. We, we need, and that law must be repealed. I think it must be repealed uh, uh, without fail. And I believe the president may be listening, and I'm sure he's probably thinking, because the level of outcry against that ally is humongous. Uh, and, and I've heard some people say that, oh, but parliament passed the law. Uh, we have two parties in parliament and all that. I think that is unnecessary when it is a problem. And, and, and those of you who have been in parliament, honorable is here, the way parliament works, when it's an ally, it is placed in parliament, and if there's no objection anywhere, if there's no debate, 21 days, it's a law. And the person who told me that the law, there's a, the, he said it was a parliamentarian law. If you are not careful, there's a law coming which would allow for mining in the forest. And then I checked. I said, but the law has been passed. Said, no, no, it hasn't been passed. Then there's a parliamentarian. He didn't even know that that law had been passed. So it was from the executive, came to the legislature. Please, executive, go and repeal that law. It is inimical to our environment. It is inimical, inimical to our well-being. And, and let us accept that. Let us not trivialize the, the situation. I have heard people, in fact, me, even me, my picture has gone round, saying, listen to Dr. Tony Omi. He's saying, I never have written. Let me Google, you'll find what I've done. Uh, you know, I went to a place observing. I went to some of the, the, the community mining and other mining places. Never spoke a word. Never uttered a word. Yet, it became an issue that somebody is you know, for, uh, asking them. And even if, if I would ask them without accepting that, to mind, am I that a powerful person to be able to cause this guy? You know, it's a, it's a serious problem. It's not about talk talk, it's about action. So I think that, first of all, Mr. President must announce, must come back to fellow Ghanaians again and say, fellow Ghanaians, no mining on water bodies. And when you are seen mining, straight away, uh, and I believe you will do that. Um, fellow Ghanaians, I said we should, we should do the the forest, where they were mining in the forest, but uh, no, we have taken it out. I think it will bring confidence. Otherwise, nobody is confident that we are able to resolve this. When, when you talk to oh, the same things, talk, talk, let us see action. The, the use of military is good, but not sustainable. It has been done before. A few years ago, I was in Ivory Coast on his OECD program, and I told them, yes, you know, there's a natural thing that goes on. If you send soldiers to places where the person is going to stop. So soldiers are probably one of the, the most honest group now, I mean, in this country, yeah, in terms of discipline. These days, Krapo, they are learning the bad habit of other people. Otherwise, soldiers could be said to be one of the most disciplined people. Yet, you take the guy there, and there were some soldiers who went there and said they won't be soldiers again. They resigned because there was proper job in court there that gave them more money. Uh, I heard, and I don't know for a fact, that there were soldiers who were being prepared to go to Congo for, you know, in those days, when General and Co were there, going to Lebanon was a very good thing for you. But that's where you got some dollars and all that. These days, rather, they would want to go and, and, and protect Galamse and then uh, and, and, uh, earn some more money. So you send a soldier who, who can be, you know, convinced with some 50,000 something, he might decide between his God and his family what to do. So it is good, show of force is good, but it's not a permanent solution. We need to have a permanent solution to, to small scale mining. That will not destroy our forest. I have, I, 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 I have a lot to say, but I think others might say something, and I also believe that the conversation is not ending. In fact, the conversation should not end uh, before action. Actions should start now before the conversation can continue. I thank you very much and God bless us all. Thank you very much, Dr. Tony Aubin.